I think three things in a row now that have been received very well. Pretty rare for me to be honest that. Um, I've worked hard, I've always worked hard, but like, you know, a lot of it's timing and being the right thing at the right time. And um, But I've been lucky this year with, with work-wise that, you know, a couple of things have 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 been liked, not only critically, but, but lots of people have watched it. It's unimaginably difficult. Um, I still have moments where I'm in denial about it, and I think I've just not stopped. I, I mean, I literally didn't stop. I, I, Dad died. I had three days left of hotel quarantine, stuck in a room with my wife and kids, and uh, that was like nothing I would ever wish on anybody. And then ten days after Dad died, I started shooting the tourist. And I, it was the most grueling schedule of a job I've ever done. It was the longest job I've ever done. It's the furthest away from home I've ever been. We are in Australia for five months. Um, but I don't know, something takes over and you're like, well, listen, I'm here to do a job. And actually, it's probably good for me just to throw everything at this. Twenty years is a long time to be away. But last year was the first year that I've lived longer away from Belfast or from you know, the island than I have there. Even if you wanted to shake it, which I don't, you, you can't, it, everyone calls it home. I've got big plans to be home for a long time. I've, I've, I've written something we are planning on making our film at some point, which will hopefully be at home. Um, a lot of things have to fall in place and people have to give us money and <laughs> everything to make it happen. But um, yeah, that's a plan at some point.